guys, it's Chrysler, and today I'm doing a very important video for my fellow hooded eyed girls or guys. And it is all about applying false lashes and which ones look good and will flatter your eye shape. And this took me quite a little bit of time because there are so many different types of false eyelashes out there and you never know what's going to look good on you until you try it. Just from looking at a pair of lashes in its little pack, I can tell if it's going to look good on me or not. So I'm here to help you and I hope this helps you out. So let's get right into the tips. So the basic tools you're going to need to apply these falsies is a liquid eyeliner of your choice. I prefer one with a brush tip. It helps get in easily in between those eyelashes. A mascara that doesn't curl your lashes too much, but you definitely want to make sure that it holds a curl, like it doesn't curl them while you're applying your eyelashes, but this one actually does. A soft coal eyeliner of your choice, a pair of tweezers or a false eyelash applicator, some lash glue, and a pair of falsies. So when I first started watching YouTube videos long ago and I saw everyone putting on false eyelashes, I was eventually like, let's do it. Because we all know that false lashes can make your look just from level like 7 to level like 20 because they really flatter a dark smoky eye or if you're wearing a natural look and you want to instantly look more dramatic you can pop on a pair and you're gonna look instantly just fabulous. fabulous. So I remember when I went to the drugstore and I wanted a pair of falsies, the ones that I was lusting over were the Ardell Demi Wispies. Everyone talks about these. If you go to the store, they're probably going to be sold out unless you get lucky because that's what happened to me. And I still have them and I kept them for the purpose of this video, but I don't actively wear them. The last time that I actually wore these was in the ColourPop makeup tutorial, which I'll put a card right here if you want to see what they look like on. But even then, like in the pictures that I took, I just think that they looked so large, so out of control, but I figure like just try it and if we like it then then we'll, we'll, we'll keep them. But I kept these for the purpose of this video so I can show you why I don't like them and talk about it. So the three pairs that I'm going to show you that I think look amazing on hooded eyes are the sexies, which I'm wearing right now. The babies, which are like a half lash. They make your eyelashes look like they have a butterfly effect. And the 124. They aren't as long and the longest eyelashes are in the middle and then the shortest on the ends. And they are all by the brand Ardell. Of course, other brands sell lashes similar to these, but these are just the ones that I have. So let's get in depth and do the comparison of why these lashes are better than the wispies. You can see from the top that the demi wispies are thicker. But you can always find lashes that are thicker that are similar to the next point that I'm going to make as to why these are different. So here's a side view of the lashes and you can off the bat tell that the demi wispies are way more curled. The ends of the lashes are not at all touching the white except for maybe on the inner corner, but you can see that the other three, the ends touch the white plastic part and that's what you want. If you get lashes that are super curled, when you put them on, it's almost going to touch your eyelid or it will touch your eyelid. So I find that a lash that is more flat or has a tiny bit of a curve looks way better. And if you have straight lashes, I think this looks more natural because if you give your lashes a squeeze with your eyelash curler and put them on top, they're just going to blend in better. So when you're looking at lashes, be sure to pay attention to what the curve looks like because if it's really curved, then I would stay away from it. I would look for ones that have a little bit of a curve. So now that I've shown you the difference between the lashes, I'm actually going to show you on my eyeballs. One side I'm going to make the do and one side the don't. And I actually think I switched that around. So let's get right into the demo. All right, so now that we're up close and personal, let's start. So of course I'm going to just put on some eyeliner. My eyeliner always comes off, but I like to do bottom and top to make sure it's balanced or else I just look plain weird. And then I'm going to tight line and this is just going to help the lashes look like they blend in a little bit better. And this is obviously the technique um, just to make your lashes look thicker in general. And I really like this Japanese um, eyeliner because it's really creamy and it goes on really smoothly. So to help the eyelashes kind of blend in, I'm going to apply a thin line on my upper lash line. And I'm using the Physicians Formula Pen one. Mm -hmm. 
So there is my eyeliner. I just applied mascara to my bottom lashes and now I'm going to apply it to my top lashes. But I'm going to put it on very lightly and this mascara actually curls my lashes. But if you do have really straight Asian lashes, then you can give them a little bit of a curl so they have something to sit on so they lift up. But my eyelashes, um, they have a little bit of a curl to them. So I'm just going to leave them like this. I'll zoom in so you can see. So if you see this eye, you can see that it actually curls if I look straight. So that's the reason why I'm not going to be curling my eyelashes. Just enough to coat my lashes because if you put on eyeshadow, your eyelashes might get some of that shadow on there and then it'll make them look lighter. So that's a very light coat. Now on this eye, I'm going to curl my eyelashes. Oh my god. So there you go, those eyelashes are curled and I'm going to apply mascara. Is this a cameo? What are you doing? Oh, you're gonna... He's gonna sniff... sniff my makeup brushes. <laughs> Alright, back to the video. So now for the don't, I'm going to apply the Demi Wispies. So I'm just applying a very thin layer of this glue. And then I take tweezers and I like to grab the very center as you can see and I wait till it starts to turn clear and then I put them on. I just place them on. So there is the Demi Wispies. Um, they do look kind of okay if you like this look and that's what you want to go for then by all means do it, but I'm going to show you what I like to do with the other pair of lashes. So not curling them, I'm just going to take the sexies. So these are the eyelashes, and as you can see, with hooded eyes, if you have like an eye look on this eye, you'd be able to see the eyeshadow a lot better than this eye. You can't see right now, but this is actually like touching my eyelid and it just looks so unnatural. It's just not the way I like my eyelashes to look. But if you want to wear the Demi Wispies, like I said, you can totally go for it. It's just not what I think is very flattering on myself. So those are all the tips. I hope this video was helpful to any of you out there. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then please give it a thumbs up and you can subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll see you guys next time.